All right, sorry I had to leave for the night. I was getting lit up on Discord by some friends, and we decided to play some games together. But, I do believe we got the gas in the car, yeah? So, we can go places, we can do things, but, life and living is on, so I'm hoping I can catch it still. I just realized what time it is. God, please tell me I didn't miss it. <laughs> I need a smoke. Oh. Thank God we caught it. Carpentry. Ah, oh, dude, I have a, like, the worst headache today. I think I, like, cranked my neck while I was sleeping. I don't know, this shit hurts. <laughs> Two seconds. Alright, cool. We caught that life and living. We got a skill in carpentry. Which is nice. And, uh, yeah, we still need to find a backpack and stuff. So, we have a little bit of a journey. Take the next goal. What's the school? But, I think we have a working car now. So, that being said... I think we can drive over to the school. So that might be the start of it. Just trying to remember what car was I uh, filled up. I think it was this one. Oh, come on. Yeah, let's go. We got a vehicle. Alright, we are headed over to the school. Get ourselves a backpack. We just have to be ready to dip before, uh... That's not good. As I was saying, be ready to dip as the chopper event hits, depending on what chopper event it is, because I do have a mod that randomizes it, or changes it up a bit. It's a rather quiet piece of the dark. I like it. Zombies, for the ones out front, anyway. Oh, there's some quite a few in here. removed. Mm -hmm. 
kind of hoping this place isn't like jam packed with a bunch of zombies. Hold up. All right. Oh, there's a bunch in there. We need to make this quick. We need to find a bag. All right, we're good. We're good. We need to be ready to dip as soon as possible. So I'm checked. All right, let's put this. In. Fill this up with stuff. All right, let's go. Let's go this way. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> There's quite a few zombies in there. Quite a few more than what I'm comfortable with. Alright, let's take a look at our map. I say we go up to the gas station and uh, fill up. I mean, we're out anyway, might as well. God damn, dude. This thing does not like coming to a stop, though. It likes going real fast, like. Gotta be careful on how quick I go. Few, uh, few zombies to kill. Oh, oh steak. Yeah, I don't think these are vampires. Oh, come on. How can I? There we go. No, no, thank you. Not getting a cheap one on me. Heard you coming from a mile away. Cop had some stuff on him. Stuff that I kind of want. <laughs> Take the holster and let's refill. Finally, are starting to get a little drowsy. Alright, so this is what I'm gonna do. Right here. I'm gonna take out the uh, shotgun, I'm gonna put that in the passenger seat. 
Gonna take the handgun and throw that also in the passenger seat. Get the book bags, throw these in here. Also throw the holster back here as well. And, uh, yeah, let's go read this up a little bit. Now that we have some stuff. Alright. Let's just stock up. survive. Find the move. We don't have time to hang out. Yep, time to go. That's all she wrote. There was a uh, board on the way. And we're filled up, so we're good. We can now bail out when we need to. Got some food. And there's still the Gigamar. We can always set up the Gigamar. Still quite a few zombies. Son of a bitch. Perfect. We are ready to go at pretty much any time. Okay. So, that was another thing marked off our map. School's good. Gas station's good. We still have the Gigamart. We still have the police station for weapons. Then we can start looting some houses for some... Sorry. Various things. Well, hey, look at all the, all the snackage we got. <laughs> Now, as much as I'd like to sort that all upstairs, I don't think I'm going to. What I'm going to do is take the empty school bag. I'm going to equip that on our back. And take the one that has all the stuff in it. 
And we're going to put that back with this one. Or back in the other seat. So we have two school bags, each with food and stuff. And I want to start getting, uh, getting some of the guns as well. Chainsaw screwdriver, we can put that in our backpack. Alright, so we can put the lighter in there as well. Blood wrench we can put in the back of the car. Uh, chainsaw would be cool and all. Couple axes, hammer pick a sledgehammer is huge. Let's grab the axes as well. And a shovel. That's all gonna be useful stuff. Hammer as well, which we cannot bring with us. And we'll grab a pickaxe. We're gonna throw this in the back of the car. So, we'll take a shovel, lug wrench, and two axes. And the sledgehammer. We'll keep that all in there. The hammer out, put that in my backpack. Grab the shotgun. Grab this pistol as well. Let's even see if we can grab this one. Unfortunately not. Okay. So, let's place it. Okay. Still heavy somehow. Probably with the pickaxe, yeah? So, yeah, I guess let's take the pickaxe and uh, we'll place that also on the table. There we go. Let's go upstairs, see if we uh, roll back any zombies this way real quick. We missed an episode of Life and Living, which I think it's survival too. So, damn. Does not look like we brought any. Okay, we're clear. So yeah, yeah, that's two objectives down. We can always go grab more food as well, but we do have very limited storage space. I think our next bet's gonna be the guns gun area. However, Let's also check some of the uh, local houses and stores, see if we can find some, like, books and stuff. But I think we're going to save that for tomorrow. So, guys, I will see you all in the morning. Be back in a minute. Okay, we are back. It's a little earlier than I wanted to wake up, but it's, it's okay. Important thing is, we did wake up. Oh, shit. That sounded like a crash jet. See what we have available to us right now. Chocolate, we have some apples. Let's eat the fresh stuff first. Alright, we're good. Yeah, that sounded like a crash jet. We might be able to uh get some good loot from that. <laughs> See if that uh stirred up any any zombies. Does not look like it did.
Okay, so let's see what we have to work with. We could raid the police station. We got some duct tape, definitely useful, especially for repairing. Okay, another sledgehammer. Damn, Garnsaw, huge. Not screwdriver, WD-40. Use a clean firearms. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, so we have a couple options. We could knock one of the last things off the list here, the police station. Get some more firearms and stuff to go kinda so we can go Rambo on some of the zombies. Or we can start searching up these houses for other things. Or what I might add to the goals here is fortify this place up a little bit. Buy us a little extra time when the chopper event comes. And we have a few zombies kind of not welcome here. Sorry guys, didn't invite ya. Gonna have to politely ask you to leave with my axe. Gonna have to ask, ask them to leave. Digital watches, I am gonna take those. Military boots, we already got some military boots. Alright. Now the police station is just a uh, short walk over here, so. Zombies over there. Just behind a little fence here. Decent sized group there. More guns. Might us be able to find some body armor. We might be able to thin the herd out by calling. Trying to get them to come individually. We did grab the attention of one. try to split this group up a little bit. Make them a little bit easier to manage. We can get in that back room. Police station, get some guns. Reset. set. There, we got a small group of them. Good, good, good. At least two, so they might have like some more firearms or something on them. Some more weapons, some more guns, some ammo. Okay, we'll prove us. Not in the best condition, but I'll grab it. some scratch and bite protection at least on her chest still a few more a small group over there as well back over here. Okay, we do have a bit of a group on us. Let's see what she 
Okay. Well, we have some guns. <laughs> guys no unfortunately you didn't see a watch you kind of want to grab that so I think that's how we can disassemble that more guns of course okay let's go uh place these Overall, not too bad. Not too bad. Okay, we have this USAS 12, which we can place here. We have this as well, so we can place this kind of, I guess, on the edge here. Couple handguns, which of course we could also place kind of over here by the pickaxe. Look at that, let's go. Look at all our guns. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, my axe has definitely seen better days, so I think. Let's see if I can repair it. We have the duct tape to do so. Alright. I'll buy us a little more time with the axe. I know I have plenty more. But that's not the point. Alright, back to the police station. Grab more stuff. I need more stuff. And I realize this is only going to occupy, like, the first part of the day. <laughs> oh, shit, dude, we need nails. Alright, let's clear the rest of the, uh... Kind of, like, the front of the police station a bit. There's still a few of them out here. not there a second ago. Alright. I have to make this quick then. Okay, I know there's a group over there. But I gotta kinda be sneaky here. Proof vest. Let's put that one on instead. The one I'm wearing. Shit. Alright. That one's the equipped one. Where is the one that I didn't? I'm going to quickly drop that. Okay, this is a sketchy part because they can sneak up on me, so I gotta be very careful. I can't lock it, so we have to disassemble the door. So, uh, carefully watching behind me.
Okay. There we go. Get down there real quick. Let's hammer back over here. Okay, I think we're good. <laughs> so, we have a suppressor, cold steel carfish. Oh boy. I don't know if I could fit all that in my backpack. Not gonna lie. Okay, we're gonna have to make another trip. We have to sneak with all this. All while being able not really to run. Or not being able to run very well. We are taking damage from this, unfortunately. As long as we stay nice and quiet, we should be okay. That's the tricky bit. Alright, we're good, we're good. There's a lot of stuff here. A lot more guns, a lot more ammo. If we can find a truck, that'd be even better. I'll be able to carry a lot more stuff, or like a trailer, maybe. Oh yeah, we have exertion now. Finally, we've taken quite a bit of damage just from carrying all this weight, but thankfully, we have to go far. We are definitely going to have to chill for a minute, though, for sure. And we're just going to place all this here in the armory. Oh, boy. Quite a bit of weight. Moved and let's get the guns. All right, we have a full of stock shotgun. And a suppressor for a rifle, huh? So we can put that on pretty much everything. So we're gonna put it like right here. <laughs> yeah, we need to chill for a hot minute. <laughs> we're not feeling good. And just in time to almost catch life and living. So, grab a snack. Grab a little bit of sugar. And you know what? Let's grab, uh, grab this lettuce as well. So guys, we got the backpacks, we still have to finish raiding the police station a little bit, we're definitely gonna do that soon. We're pretty much almost ready, already prepared for the chopper event, I do know it's about to get real bad real quick. Still anxious and on edge. So when the chopper event hits, we're either gonna fight or run. We're stocked up and ready to run if we have to, 
but we also have enough stuff here. So I want to fortify the police station next episode. So I'm going to start doing that. Or not the police station, sorry, the fire station. We're going to fortify the fire station and make it a proper base. We're going to finish ring the police station. Then we're probably going to grab more supplies. So, all that on the next episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you next time, and peace.